Hey guys, just thought I'd post this to maybe help somebody else out who's having a similar problem that I am. I was having very low boost pressure on this uh, 2006 F250 with the 6 liter power stroke. I was carrying about 12 pounds of wide open throttle and should have been about twice that much. So a quick search of YouTube um, showed me a few things to check and the first one being the, um, the small hose going to the map sensor. It looks like this one's actually been replaced or reinforced. It's plastic shielded and I couldn't find any cracks or anything in there so that wasn't my problem. Um, next step is what Ford calls the CAC or the turbo tube here. Um, it takes, um, it's on the hot side of the turbo and goes to the intercooler. These two rubber boots can be problematic and usually it's this one here that goes out first because it's obviously it's hotter up here. So it's a harsher environment. So I've already taken this apart using um, 11 millimeter deep sockets and pulled this thing out for further inspection. And sure enough, there's, there's some wear on here and a real small crack. Um, and then I checked this side here, which looks, looks to be completely good. I cleaned it all up and everything's fine, except you can see the clamp isn't quite properly installed. And I think this was done by Ford probably because it's, it's an OEM part. It's on the bottom side, it's hard to get to. And when I did this, look what happens. Opens right up, huge leak. And that's all from this clamp being improperly installed. I've been running the truck about two years and watching the PSI going down slowly. So got this sucker ordered. We'll get a new one on and hopefully it should be a good fix. Hopefully help somebody else out that might be um, chasing the same kind of problem.